Hey everybody, I want to talk a little bit about today uh, why quitters win sometimes. And sometimes quitting might be the best thing you could do strategically for work, life, and even in your jiu-jitsu. So I'm going to try to cover as much as I can in as short of an amount of time as possible. So we'll talk about a little bit why quitting might be the best option for you. Let's talk about it in work or job, career. Sometimes quitting a dead-end or stagnated job might give you the opportunity to pursue further interests or take those courses, those certifications, the schooling necessary to move forward. It may allow you to apply for the job that you've wanted for a long time and parlay your experience into the new job. It may give you the opportunity to start your own business as well. I know for me, uh, when I dropped out of college, I already had enough credits to become a cop. That was the original goal of what I wanted to do. And when the opportunity to become a police officer arose, I was given the opportunity to be an apprentice, essentially, in a martial arts school. And now here I am, eight years late, nine years later, running my own school. So for me, quitting school and quitting my application with the NYPD led me to the place that I am right now. And the quit didn't mean I stopped doing everything. It just allowed me to move forward. When we talk about quitting in our jiu-jitsu, it's a really important one. It's a really underlying point to the way you need to learn. And sometimes people need to learn how to learn by quitting with their ego, quitting with their strength, quitting with their instincts sometimes. And a lot of our instincts like pushing from the bottom in the bottom of the mount or stacking a triangle or standing straight up while you're in an arm lock, all completely wrong. And you have to quit that way of thinking and allow the instructor to give you the advice necessary to move forward. And sometimes quitting some of those bad habits will allow you to really progress further. We're not saying stop training, but we're saying quit some of that bad stuff you may have brought onto the mat. So empty your cup, so to speak. And then in our lives, sometimes quitting is really important, whether that be a bad relationship, bad habits, and it's, it's important to kind of take a check up from the neck up and find that if we're smoking or drinking or sleeping too much or not getting enough sleep, too many video games, sometimes quitting those things will pay huge dividends later on. A reminder of that Vince Lombardi quote that winners never quit and quitters never win, but it's actually not true. Sometimes quitting is a strategic move that you could use to move forward. And when you quit, you got to fill it with something else. You got to quit and take a chance, add some risk. And when you add risks, sometimes those risks pay off. So my encouragement for you, if you're not where you want to be, make something happen, change it. Good luck.